hello everybody in this video we need to take a look at a new build uh for a sword you asked me to make to, you asked me to make a build for a sword and here we have a board sword i think it's the first build i'm actually creating for the board sword if i'm not mistaken so uh as you can see this one is powerful pushback extra damage level one reduced with uh potion cooldown which is refreshment level three so we are using the new enchantment for the eden depths dlc uh, which of course refreshes our reduce our cooldown for the healing potion and as you can see here the spider armor comes in built in potion barrier we also have critical hit committed and exploding right now exploding uh if i kill with exploding it won't cause the cooldown but exploding is one of the enchantments that you really don't want to uh to miss because you reduce uh eliminate a group of enemies faster reduce uh, the hp for other enemies so we can easily uh eliminate them with your sword uh, if they're kind of an auto circle around you very very powerful uh, we also have chilling gravity pulse um and uh final shout uh this is why heavy by the way i didn't have anything better here but this is replaceable uh but just in case i'm getting a bit low uh what will activate well defense at extra attack of course and defense extra defense i want an amulet and of course speed uh so this is just kind of uh make sure that i won't die now one thing you can actually notice in the game plan right now is how kind of i'm brute forcing my way through and uh, this is of course thanks to the exploding as well and uh, this is why i say exploding is absolutely amazing you can also pay attention how much time it takes me to get the healing portion back and as you can see <coughs> not this don't notice this <laughs> um how fast i'm actually hitting with the sword uh because of the spider armor and of course i'm healing because of the leeching also getting health back and uh they're clear of enemies a large group of enemies is very very fast uh i don't care if they're enchanted or not i'm actually using those who have rhp to deal damage to nearby enemies because of the exploding uh and it's really fun because the sword although slow uh gets kind of a speed with the mushroom and also from the 25 percent attack speed of the spider armor look at this i'm not stopping by the way i'm always moving forward if you play this in apocalypse plus 25 which what it is what you see here uh even if i'm taking other uh raid captains i took like i think several of them it was still a uh, piece of cake uh, you know that sometimes you know you're kind of missing something but with this build i'm just pushing through without stopping just jumping through continuing it doesn't matter what's actually waiting for me on the other side i know i can actually deal with this and this is kind of one of the things that it makes me uh, make it enjoyable to play this build uh compared to other builds that might require some kind of uh you know timing at certain things or just a bit of wait for certain cooldowns here you just uh, move forward and uh regarding the um the bow by the way it's a reduced cooldown and uh, speed uh i don't know if it's a perfect one but it does the job uh, uh reducing the further reducing the cooldown of my artifact that's why you see me rolling quite a bit when i'm actually playing when i engage i just roll uh to kind of uh, get those cooldowns uh you know reduced a bit more uh, as much as i can and that's all lead to a very very smooth uh and fun gameplay uh yeah so this is the build uh again if i make changes i'm gonna uh, kind of uh, update it in the comment section i'm gonna pin the comment but overall it just looks absolutely amazing it's really really fun to play the final shot is actually a nice one by the way it's not bad but i personally prefer to have deflector uh, kind of reduce the incoming damage for enemies uh, far away from me so as you can see here i'm continuing kind of getting everything any captain rate captain the drops a flag is just going to pick up the flag because i really have a trust in this build to help keep me alive uh well although keep in mind that if you get minus 60 uh you know it can be a bit rough for any build by the way uh, as long as i have kind of uh, my potion barrier there which was missing for me uh, i have spider armors but not with potion barrier now with potion barrier uh, yeah it's kind of a walk in the park and again finally i can actually enjoy a really good sword build with a spider armor of course it doesn't mean that you just need to go to spider armor this is just a variation of it uh you can have some armors with uh, extra damage and stuff but this is kind of fun because of the uh, extra speed that you get uh and the healing when you actually hit with a weapon 
So overall, it just feels great. And for me, it's important to actually feel that I'm enjoying the build, not just that it's, uh, you know, uh, efficient. It has to be also fun to play. So this is it for this video. Hope you enjoyed this one. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And I'll see you soon for the next video. Thanks for watching.